What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another Tesla video. Uh, in this one, it's not gonna be a super long video, uh, most of mine aren't, but uh, I wanna talk about uh, autopilot and uh, when you take off your seatbelt. So, <laughs> sounds strange, I know. Uh, autopilot is running right now, and the minute I unbuckle my seatbelt, you're gonna watch a screen, okay? And it will flicker, it's gonna be red, it's gonna say take over, uh, but, uh, autopilot will still be engaged. So, taking off my seatbelt. So, basically, uh, it, it's rather fascinating. Uh, the minute you take off your seatbelt, that pops up, and autopilot is still enabled. The only way you take off that screen is by taking off autopilot. So, you can flip the stock up, you can talk the wheel and uh, pull it over or you can tap on the brake uh, you know autopilot is still engaged because of the wheel being tight so I'll do it one more for one more time for you guys watch my hands on the wheel and you can see how it stays tight uh, forgot to put on autopilot before I start so hold on let's try that again All right. so you can see the wheel here it's tight it's not going anywhere uh, so anyway I thought it was kind of interesting I thought it was kind of interesting. I haven't seen this shared anywhere. Uh, just kind of fascinating because I know there are videos out there or people in the past where they did something and then they basically took off their seatbelt and went and sat in the back or whatever. It's not possible, at least with the latest firmware. This is what Tesla's done to prevent that. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this short little quick tidbit of a video. Uh, if you guys enjoyed it, make sure you do subscribe for the latest and greatest Tesla content. I have all sorts of really cool and fun things on the way. Uh, make sure to like the video because it always helps. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Are there any other like really random obscure autopilot like ways to bring on that screen? Let me know in the comments down below. And uh, most importantly, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.